All right. So today in church, Reverend Mansfield is going to be talking about Jesus. So he was a great teacher of the past, and the Bible and the Torah are based on his teachings and are full of great truths. So one of Jesus' favorite ways of teaching lessons was by telling stories. He told stories that were easy because they were easy for us to remember. And he told stories that had a lesson in them. It's called a parable or a fable. So one of the parables that Jesus told was about a lamp and a basket. He said that no one would light a lamp and then hide it under a basket. That would be silly. It wouldn't make any sense. You can't use the light if it's covered up, right? So, but what Jesus meant by this was that we all have a light within us and that we should share it with everybody. We need to share our unique spark with the world. And we should not hide it, we should let it shine brightly. And if you guys remember, we talked a few weeks ago about how we all have our own uniqueness that we share with the church. It's the same message. And we still have them um, hanging up on the tree back there if you wanna go take a look. So talking about lighting a lamp and letting our light shine makes me think of something else that's important in our church. Do you guys have any idea of what I'm thinking about? Something we light every Sunday? How about you, Rowan? Got an idea? Our chalice, that's right. And so our chalice represents the light of truth. And it is important to us as Unitarian Universalists that the light of truth shines brightly and that it's not hidden. So I wear a chalice necklace every day to help me remember this. And it also helps me to remember that I'm unique and that I should let my own light shine brightly. And so you guys got to help me with this part. So the flame of the chalice lights my path of peace, truth, and love. Very good. All right. Uh, Kaylin, would you like to come help us like, carry the flame over today? So we have to uncover our flame here, right? All right. From generation to generation, we light this flame of religious freedom. And now we will all follow Kaylin out as we go off to our religious exploration classes and sing Go Now in Peace. <laughs> 